What is up, you awesome kisters? It is Sister Axe here. Here with a quick reminder before the video starts. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, hit that black bell, and click send me on notifications if you want notifications for every single video that comes out on the channel. Make sure you guys take five seconds to just literally hit the like button. I mean, 2,000 people, 191 likes. Come on, I know we can do better. And make sure you guys comment below anything you feel about the video or just reaction requests. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoy the video. What is up, you awesome kisters and assist reacts here, guys? And today we're gonna be doing another unboxing video. So yeah, it's been a long time since I made an unboxing video for the channel, and this unboxing video is gonna be very beneficial because I'm gonna be unboxing, uh, and I and I'm pretty sure I need this, but a lot of you just haven't been telling me. Today I'm gonna be unboxing the Logitech Brio. Uh, it's a it's their newest camera. It has 4K quality and 60 FPS. So yeah. Uh, goodbye to old, um, Logitech C920. Yeah, I've been using the Logitech C920 since this channel started, so it's gonna feel weird not using this camera for videos. So, uh, yeah, um, today is the worst day to not have nails. Alright, guys, we are back. So, yeah, um, <laughs> took me a couple of seconds to get this open. Okay, I, I really hope in editing I really remember to cut me trying to get uh, the plastic off because that'd be a cringy eight seconds of your life. So yeah, anyway, here it is smelling like fresh. Uh, the new Logitech Brio looks pretty freaking awesome. Uh, God, Lord, this is so cold. But uh, yeah, here's the camera. You guys just seen that? There's the camera. And uh, in this little last box right here, we just have uh, what I'm. A eek. Oh, eek. <laughs> okay, we have what I'm assuming um, USB 3 cord, and we got some type of camera bag. Guess I can use that for. What I'm, uh, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I, I just know I can use it for something. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So I will see you guys. Uh, when the camera is being used and uh, I can give you guys my review on it and how I uh, Think of it. So yeah, I'll see you guys when I'm using the camera itself And let me know in the comments below if you guys want me to raffle off <laughs> some of my old equipment um, For a giveaway or something like that because I know you guys have been asking me what's the best equipment to use So if I did like a youtuber equipment giveaway, let me know if you guys want that because I have uh, let me tell you guys, I have a Razer Siren Pro that's in my closet. Um, I switched it out with my old microphone. Yeah, this is this microphone right here. I'm sorry if you can hear all this. This microphone right here is what I used to start Sister Reacts. Actually, no, I used the Blue Snowball. Yeah, I still have that too. I have a Blue Snowball in my closet and a Razer Siren Pro in my closet. And I have a Elgato HD60 in my closet. And I have this Logitech C920. So if you guys want me to raffle those off, let me know. Anyway, I'll see you guys when I'm using the camera. Sorry for talking too long. What is up guys? We are back and as you can see everything looks uh, Freaking amazing. It feels like Christmas again. So yeah, um, if you're if your internet can support 60 FPS Turn it on right now and embrace The new quality. So yeah guys as you can see the lot Log the Logitech uh, Brio is a 4k 60 fps camera and i'm using the 1080p 60 fps right now but as you can see it looks great it, it just looks amazing so yeah as you guys can see now my face cam will be 60 fps in my videos as well so perfect so yeah we got a new quality thing going on here now for my review overall on the camera i've been sitting down messing with it this camera just gets a 10 out of 10. Not only did it help me achieve 60 FPS for, on my face cam for the first time on the channel, it looks great. You can make the you can make the camera as colorful as you want. You can make you can make the camera zoom in as much as you want with its app or just what the uh, app you're using to record with. Uh, it has white light three and HDR, which just it's it's just perfect in itself. And another thing about the camera is it does uh, it. What what a good thing that this camera does is if you're in a lighting it will adjust it 
whatever lighting you're in, you can be in like the darkest lighting ever. It will adjust to that lighting to help to help you out to record videos better, and I do like that. And if you're in like a high lighting like I am right now, it will adjust, and it just did. I I didn't mess around with the settings at all. It just adjusted. You guys can see. <laughs> The adjusting is pretty great. Now, the problems with the Logitech, uh, you know, it's a review too. <sighs> uh, there's a lot of goods to this, but there's also a lot of bads. When someone opens the box, they're going to think, okay, so I'm going to plug this to my USB 3 on my computer. I did that, and you can see on the screen now, if I, if I added this edit in here, you can see that I had a distorted um, outcome, like... The the camera was the camera was choppy. My face looked like something out of a horror movie, like you know the distorted effects that they add in a horror movie, like uh, Unfriended. Yeah, my camera looked like something out of Unfriended. Okay, that that horror that Skype horror movie. Go check it out, cause that's what my that's what my camera looked like when I first plugged it in my USB three and yeah yeah I said it right um USB three. So yeah, I, I plugged it in, and I went to the support forums, and they didn't say anything about, like, USB 3 issues. And I, after an hour of, uh, after an hour and just trying to mess with the camera to make it work better. And by the way, like, I couldn't get this to work for life. I, I, I uninstalled the driver and reinstalled it. Still didn't work. I restarted my computer. Still didn't work. I, um, uh, what else did I do? Oh yeah, I went to I went to OBS, and I tried to change it to 1280, and in 60 FPS, and it didn't work. It, it acted like I set it up to like 5K or something like that, and that's why my screen looked all distorted. So yeah, I wish the box would have told you if USB 3 doesn't work, then maybe maybe plugging it in to your uh, USB 2 would work. Cause yeah, after an hour of like looking through support forums. I only just needed to just plug it into my USB 2, and that made me so mad that I couldn't figure that out because there was no things in the box. The only things in the box were like, uh, it was like a small piece of paper that just told you how to set it up, and another piece of paper about like, uh, the power, you know, what it can do, all that other stupid stuff that doesn't help you out. So yeah, I just, I just, I, I, I just wish. It would have, it would have said somewhere. Warning: If USB three doesn't work, maybe you should just plug it in. It's recommended to be plugged into the USB two. I wish there was just more, you know, direction other than just trying to figure out how to do it in the dark. So yeah. Anyway, guys, that's pretty much it. It's a good camera. It, it's a really, it's a uh, camera. It's a really good webcam. I really recommend the Logitech Brio or the Logitech C920. I, I, I recommend any uh, Logitech camera. It, it's a really good uh, recording slash streamer thing. A lot of streamers use it. Anyway, yeah, this is this is the only thing that left you it right. To da to download camera settings software for this product, please visit Logitech. And they only give you the download, and your camera would have been dark, and you wouldn't know what to do. Like I was, like I, like I, um, like I did. Because on the software, my camera was dark, but when I turned on OBS, oh my god, it was crazy. Okay, so yeah. Anyway, guys, so yeah, that was my unboxing and review on the Logitech uh, Brio. Great camera. Has a lot of issues. Has a lot of issues. Anyway, guys, I'll see you awesome kisters later. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Let me know if you guys want me to unbox more things for the channel like I used to in the past. So yeah, peace out.